I went and saw the Moonbats this weekend, and uh, they are a great oldies band. They play everything from the 50s, 60s, 70s. They play from Buddy Holly to The Doors to Vanilla Fudge. They, <laughs> they do it all. Well, they featured a lot of oldies this time because they were the, the movie they were showing after they were done was called Back to the Future. And so they plot a lot, play a lot of oldies, so I got kind of oldies mood. So this is a, Bo, a uh, Buddy Holly song. Um, it's one that the Rolling Stones covered. It's called Not Fade Away. Very simple song. It's got um, three chords in it. It's E, A, and D. Okay, and it's also got a cool Bo Diddley beat in it. That was the popular beat back in the 50s. So um, let's look at that beat. Okay, the chords, of course, are simple. E, I won't tell you how it's going to be. You're going to live your love to me. Okay, so let's look at the let's look at the uh, the beat of that. So we're starting off with on the E. We're going to go down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, up, down. Notice the last two are kind of quick. So real slow. That's the E. So and that's the first part of every of every uh, line, really. So it's just and you just speed up that last part. Okay. Then your A is up down, and then you're back to your E. Real slow. So we're playing the first two lines there. I won't tell you how it's gonna be. You're gonna give your love to me. I'm gonna love you night and day. The love is life and not fade away. The love is love and not fade away. That's a song. <laughs> that's that's it. There's a, now the, the lead part is really simple too. It's pretty cool. If we look at the lead in there, um, you start with the A chord, and you're going to play. You're going to play a. You're, you're going to go between A and D and back to A. So uh, one part is this, right? A, D, same same beat, same Bo Diddley beat. Now the high part is here. He starts with the high part. You're going to take the D shape all the way up to 10, 9, 10. That's an A. So, or I'm sorry, 9, 10, 9. So 9, 10, 9. And then for the D, you're just going to add your little finger back on 10 again. So here's your A. And then your D is the same thing, except you're adding your little finger at 10. So A is 9, 10, 9. And A is, or D is going to be 9, 10, 10. So here's how that goes. Uh, here's the lead. Then he plays the same thing back here on regular A and D. Now for the E, A, E, he does the same shapes, except he plays a 4, 5, 4 for the E. Then he adds his little finger for the five, to the 5 for A. So here's that shape again. Here's the E. Here's the E, A. Here's back to E again. And he plays the regular. Okay, so here's that riff. Here's the here it is real slow. Remember all you're doing is playing that D shape and you're adding your little finger to change that chord. Same thing in E. That's the lead. <laughs> you don't have to be a genius to make a lot of money. Buddy Holly was really smart. He wrote a lot of great songs. 
Uh, this is a good song, evidently. I mean, the Stones copied it, so it was, it was okay. So it was a fun song to do. So that's it. Let's listen to Buddy play, and we'll play right along with him. Luckily, he's in the same chord. We're the same chord shapes we are, so let's play with Buddy Holly. People said I used to look like him in high school. <laughs> I wish I had his money. Okay, here we go. Ready? Hit it, buddy. Where are you, buddy? Well, I don't. Oh, I see. I'm sorry. Let's try it again. I didn't know the sound was down. Buddy Holly, simple as pie. Not fade away. Okay, hope you like that one. That was fun. <laughs> 